Okay, it's time for another review. And this time it's a little bit different. It's of The Last of Us, episode one, which recently aired on the UK on the channel Sky Atlantic. And all obviously in, in America, it's HBO Max. Anyway, um, there are two ways to kind of, um, two times that they show it. Um, on um, Sundays, they show it, I saw it um, the, at 2 a.m. And then where, where they show it live at the same time as it is in America. I mean, I think, again, it's shown again at 9 o'clock on Mondays, I think. I'm not 100% sure. Don't quote me on that, but I'll put something in the, D in the description box if it isn't the case. So I'm, I'm corrected. Now, most of you will know, obviously, that The Last of Us is based on the video game by the developers Naughty Dog on the PlayStation consoles. Obviously, this is based on the very first game. So, for those of you who are familiar with the premise of the first Last of Us, will know the storyline and what transpires. For those of you who don't already know, it's basically tell to tell of... Um, a man and his daughter and then there's a viral outbreak which affects all humans there's a tragedy that he suffers then we fast forward um, two decades and then we see the effects of the outbreak of what this virus has had on the world and how it's destroyed hu humanity um, what I will say about it, um, in terms of it being like, um, we all know that sometimes when they do video game to movie adaptions or even TV shows, sometimes they don't often work. And I would quite, and I'm quite happy to report that this plays out exactly like the game. I would say, if anything, it even it's even more scary than the game, and it even fleshes out more of the story and even the character um, history. Even more so than what the video game does. Um, as I said before, I mean, um, the only thing, that's obviously, that's a bit kind of like different is that you're, I'm used to the voice actors and actresses in the game playing the actual characters. Um, them obviously not looking like the video game, game characters it isn't an issue. It's just you're sometimes you you get associated with the not just sometimes with the looks but the voice. But other than but. Obviously, that will take getting used to. Um, I would say with, with the first episode, the first episode is quite long, so it's about 98 minutes, or probably a little bit under that, so it's quite long. I don't know if that's going to be the normal format for the rest of the episodes. Um, I don't know if it's been really for season two, because I've been hearing rumours that, that it has been. But with this first season, you're going to get nine episodes. So again, I don't know what the length is, is going to be. It kind of reminds me of The Walking Dead. If I'm being honest, with obviously with the apocalyptic future of um, of the world, with obviously those who are familiar with the game and what's going on, it was quite um, graphic. <clears throat> I mean, it pretty much was in the video game itself, but seeing it kind of action, it's kind of um, even more graphic. Um, but as I said, the story, um, you're not going to get any surprises in the sense that they're going to tell. Um, a different story to what you saw in the video game. It's pretty much going to be exactly the same. So you're not going to kind of going to get any surprises there. So for those of you who've played the video game, um, it's going to be the story is going to be very familiar. But I wouldn't be kind of um, put off by that because, as I said, they've they've done up they've done a lot in the, in the first episode, especially to flesh out the actual events that happened in the actual video game. So, for me, um, it's done in it so far, with the first episode, it's done in it, it's done a excellent job. So those of you who are into the kind of Walking Dead kind of um, shows, I think you'll love it, even if you love it. And, if, and even if you haven't played the video games, you, I think you, people will love it and find something to, if something to enjoy. And then also, people who have played the video game, I think they'll feel very satisfied and they will enjoy um, the first episode as well. So 
it, it's really got a lot to offer but i'll say wherever you are in the world or whatever platform you are um i'll say try out the first episode i mean and, and see what you think of it but the first episode for me definitely gets a big thumbs up for me and i'm i'm already can't wait for the second episode already and it's, and it's the fact that you're gonna have to wait another week um for 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 episode two but as i said i don't know if the long format that they're using obviously how, with how long this was wherever this will um be the standard because it was just the first episode that it will be short but that's kind of going to be interesting but i'm interested in the journey in what they're going to do um with the actual storyline because as i said before it's going to be the same as the video game and even the fates the, the fates of certain characters and what happens obviously it's going to be the same which is going to be which makes it even more heartbreaking as it is because um they actually show you like a flash forward of what to expect in the season and then you see some of the familiar characters that were in um the first video game obviously there was a the one that came on the ps3 then there was the remastered and obviously they remade um the very first one and um i know there's people out there that don't like part two even though i've got it but i haven't played it yet but i know what happens um they could look if the series is successful 